There are so many amazing websites on the internet that we've decided to do another video showcasing lesser known websites. This is part three of our monthly series covering amazing websites. I'll put links in the description of this video if you'd like to check the other two out. In this video, I will show you 10 amazing websites that are either useful or entertaining that you probably didn't know existed on the internet. And we're starting right now. Number one, bug me not. If you're constantly being bugged to sign up for websites and you don't want to give out your email information, then bug me not is for you. Bug Me Not has shared logins across hundreds of sites which you can use instead of having to create a new login. Just put in a URL and then hit enter. And now you'll see a list of shared logins. Bug Me Not does not work with all websites. Number two, Sanger. Now for something completely ridiculous, I'd like for you to meet Sanger, the computer screen licking pug. To meet Sanger, just type in sanger.dk and there you go. Like I said, ridiculous. So let's move on. Number three, Netflix Roulette. With so many choices of what to watch on Netflix, do you find it difficult finding a show or movie to watch? If you do, Netflix Roulette is for you. Let me show you how it works. You go in, select a category. We'll choose comedies. You could either select show movies or show TV shows. Let's do TV shows. And there's some advanced options here for you. You can show results with a rating between one and five. We'll change that to three and five. And you can also put in a director's name, actor's name, or a keyword. And then you hit spin. And it recommends Tucker and Dale vs. Evil from 2010. And if you want to watch it on Netflix, you just click on Watch on Netflix. Number four, let me Google that for you. This one was suggested by Dr. Magpie in the comments section of another one of our videos. Let me Google that for you actually works with several search engines. Instead of having somebody else doing a search, you do the search for them. This works out well if you want to lead the other party to a specific search within Google or another search engine. Here's an example. You enter your search term. So we'll do VR Oculus. Hit enter. Click on shorten link. Copy that link. Click preview to see what happens when the recipient of your link clicks on it. And what it does is it opens a page doing a search for the recipient leading to the search results you entered. Businesses are starting to use Let Me Google That For You to lead clients to specific information about their company. I can see this being popular in the real estate sector. Number five, find the number one song on the day you were born. On the site playback.fm, they have a cool feature that lets you enter your birth date to find out what the number one song was on the day you were born. It's really simple. Just enter the month, we'll say July. Enter the day, we'll say the 21st. Make up a year here, let's go 1984. And then select find number one song. And if I were born on that date, the number one song was When Doves Cry by Prince. Number six, Scrim. There may be times when you want to have your email address on a public website. What Scrim does is it converts your email address into a different short URL that can be shared without getting picked up by email harvesters and spam robots that are constantly looking through websites for email IDs. Here's how it works. You enter your email address. I'll make something up here. You can leave the other box blank unless you want a custom Scrim URL select protect my email. Now you have a scrimmed URL which you can share on public websites. Number seven, Cat Bounce. And now for another odd website which actually exists. So go to cat-bounce.com. 
And on this site, you can make it rain cats. You can even click on the cats, pick them up, and make them bounce again. To the cat lovers out there, no cats were harmed in the production of this video. Number eight, oldversion.com. This is probably my favorite website in this video. Most of us have had this happen. We have software programs on our PC or Mac that work great, then an update to that software breaks it. This is where oldversion.com comes in. Now you can download older versions of the software you like so they could run great again on your computer. Their slogan is, because newer is not always better. I couldn't agree more. Number nine, Instructables. This site is awesome if you're a do-it-yourself kind of person. Instructables provides instructions to assist you in building just about everything. With several categories, including home, food, craft, technology, and several others, you are bound to find something to build or make. The final site to check out today is I Waste So Much Time. This website is curated with inspirational and humorous images from all around the internet. Here's one that I like. Pi Day is just a fake holiday created by math companies to sell more math. Once you get on this site, it may be difficult for you to leave. Links for this website and the others mentioned earlier are in the description of this video. That concludes our list. Thanks for watching. Let me know in the comments if you know of an amazing website that you don't think many people are aware of. Give this video a thumbs up, and if you haven't done so already, make sure to click the subscribe button below this video to learn more about the technology you use each day. For the latest and greatest in the world of technology, you're in the right place here at Tech Gumbo.